knuckle down. She'll come around eventually. Might not be a bad idea to get out of here for a while, though. You feel like going house hunting? I'm on it. Cool. Let's head down towards Marshall. I think I know a place that might suit us. Or we can just drive around for a while and see what we see. Your call. It's interesting. It's already about time to move. And certain things have not played out yet. First, I want to swing by here. Just to see what Jacob says. Boy, the town sure looks pretty empty. I don't see zombies anywhere. The outpost will take care of that group. Alright, next up is that place. So, what was that with you and Lily? Hmm, it's a long story. Not much on the radio to fill the time. Good point. My mom died when I was 13. Lily was 9. Sorry. Yeah. Anyways, not long after that was when Lily was diagnosed. Our dad, he was, um, he's kind of a wreck. I had to pick up a lot of that slack. Jacob, I need you to be a man. Help take care of your sister. You know what I mean? It was a lot for a kid to live up to. I didn't handle it well. And as soon as I turned 18, I told my dad that I was moving to Danforth and I was going to college. Yeah? <laughs> Man. And then he blew up. We had a huge fight. Didn't talk for years after that. I finally got back in touch with him just a couple of months ago, actually. This is my first visit home. Anyway, I don't think Lily's quite forgiven me yet. I don't know if he knows that his dad is dead yet. Juggernauts all over the place. I hate fighting juggernauts. <laughs> Hello, verbal criminal. stretch out in. Yeah, but can you imagine how many people we need to keep it secure? It's interesting. Uh, like, that's the current objective, but I, what did I get? Experience bonus or something? I think for wits? I know there's another one in the city. Um, it's called the Alamo. I think it's around here.
Now, that warehouse, um, in my opinion, is one of the best places to have a base. Next to the fairgrounds, obviously. The fairgrounds were great. Alright, the Alamo should be around here. This place doesn't look much bigger than the church. Yeah, but it's right in the middle of Marshall. Plenty of supply options. Plus it looks like we could build on the roof if we had to. Build on the roof? I've never uh I've never moved into uh the Alamo. I'm glad I uh, took the scenic route. What's with the giant M? I suppose it's M for Marshall? I don't know. The heck? Have I not seen this place? Before? I'm curious. Can we go inside? Contagious disease. <laughs> okay. Let's not go in there. The uh, Bronto gas stations for the Brontosaurus. It reminds me of Sinclair gas stations. I don't know of too many others, but. Uh, Let's go ahead and head over to this particular site. Well, what do you think? Check this place out. It's got a big yard, a privacy wall that we can fortify pretty easily, and check out that tree fort. We could turn that into a watchtower easy. You seem awfully excited about this place. Yeah, well, yeah, when I was a kid, my best friend Sally, she lived in this house. And I was so jealous. I always wanted to live here. Well then, let's take a look inside. Jesus! Can't see. Help me. <laughs> what the hell was that? I don't know. That that didn't look like any disease I've ever seen. You? Uh-uh. Maybe we gotta go, huh? So it requires 30 materials and 8 people. What do we got? We have 12 people and 15 materials.
Well, that's a few options at least. There might be more out there if you look around. I'll think about it. Sure. Big decision, I get it. Just remember, tree fort. Better do one more sweep. Make sure everything's clear. Twelve people, fifty materials. So we are going to need to uh We could probably beef up our defenses, just to be safe. A few more outposts would give us more of a safety net. Suppose I can go and put up some more outposts? Sure. Twelve people, fifty materials. Five people, twenty materials. Eight people, thirty materials. We should grab some more building materials, I guess. Uh, don't I have the option to have her scan for materials? She'll tell me in 10 minutes. Zombie infestation. Really? I'm on the move. You can't do everything yourself. Come home and rest. Somebody else can pick up the fly. Well, I suppose I probably could come home and rest, couldn't I? Switch to Marcus. Hey, I don't want to panic you, but we may have a problem. What happened? I've been talking to some of the other survivors. A bunch of them are talking about some new disease that's been I think we just saw it. Yeah? Well, better stock up on that. Pastor Will's not looking so great. Now the question is, is it possible to save Pastor Will? Go after the uh, armored zombie. It's closer. 